Welcome back to Stasis Geek. Us Brits, most of the time, are very subdued. Yeah, we don't over celebrate. We sometimes go over the top if it's football, rugby, cricket, and some celebration of the royal family. But no, most of the time, it's subpar. You know, we like to keep it calm. So, day two of Star Wars celebration. Is it the Brits who are to blame? Because that crowd is very low-key. <laughs> we get, you hear the odd scream. Yeah, from an enthusiastic, I'm guessing, Ray fan. But that is it. But when you watched it, it was a bit boring. It was near enough unwatchable because it was so cringeworthy. And we just got an announcement of something we already knew an announcement for, Towers of the Jedi. And that was their big announcement for the day. That was it. But there was other announcements. And you didn't have to really find it. It was every time a producer, an actor, was sitting down, getting stupid questions thrown at them. They had to tell you every time. They loved the Star Wars. I love the Star Wars. The Star Wars. It's just Star Wars. Oh, the Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. I love it. I've been into Star Wars since I was um, 10 minutes ago. Because day one, they were fine with saying, uh, yeah, I've never watched the, this uh, yeah, uh, multiverse um, kind of thing. Yeah, it was... Uh, yeah, it was interesting to be with, uh, like, everyone, you know. And, uh, yeah, it was uh, the Star Wars. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. yeah great to be, you know, with Dave. Dave knows loads about it. Just go and ask him, please. Please, don't talk to me. And then day two, every single one of them went, I love Star Wars. And then, Wee! yeah. And then you'll see from the middle of the pack, everybody's like, what's going on? Because the clapping was from the sides. So I'm guessing they've got standing people. Everybody clap. They love Star Wars. You love Star Wars. It was bad. Yesterday was so cringeworthy. It was beyond bad. They had no idea what to do with this day. So we've got now day three. I'm still thinking it's going to be a, a Kenobi season two. Well, we kind of knew that already. Or a little snippet. Uh, what else is there going to be? You might get a, a, a new game announced. Yeah. If they're going to go Jedi Survivor, well, that's near enough released. Yeah, it's coming up. So that wouldn't be that wouldn't be anywhere. So the only other thing, it would be a great kick in the balls. This, but this, if it was an announcement, is to bring actually Ryan Johnson is going to do a trilogy, because that would you know that would diminish <laughs> even your most diminished fan out of the way. That's it, push him because. I hate to say it, like the backlash they've got on social is not very good. You know, you can you kind of look for the positives, but they're outweighed. It's it's a shame. I don't know what it. It's a, like KK's last swing at everyone. This f you, George. I'm gonna ruin everything before I step out the door because at this point there's no going back. Unless you've, <laughs> you do the world between worlds. Let's hope so. Let's hope so. Because there needs to be a bit of a something change. But yeah, there's oh, awful beyond awful. Day two celebration is more than forgettable. Oh, what happened? Oh, what happened on that day? Hmm. You got some Hasbro toys announced. Great. You know, that's it. Well, I'm going to keep my eye on. Day three. <laughs> Let's find out if actually anything happens. But remember, if you got a takeaway from this video, it is I love Star Wars. <laughs> I have collectibles. I love it. Believe me. Believe me. Because that's what they're simping to at the moment. It's <laughs> bad beyond belief. But give us your comment. No, no. Let's be honest. If you were like Tales of the Jedi before I sign off. That's good. I liked it. But it's a short. So just be honest with yourselves there. It's a short. But yes, give us a comment if you want to comment. And give us a like if you want to like. As always, Stasis Geek. Out.